Hi guys, I hope you're all well and welcome back to my channel for a new video today and as you can see by this very full rail behind me I'm going to be sharing with you my favourite coats. You guys know I love my coats. I have a little bit of a coat problem like when it comes to this time of year I'm literally like oh my god I need a new coat or I love that coat, I love that coat and I have to sort of do like a one in one out system now because I'm like right okay Sometimes I'm like, oh, do I need that coat? But when it's like a really nice classic style, a really timeless piece, I'm just an absolute sucker for a coat. So I thought it'd be really nice to share with you guys my autumn winter coats. Um, I just love every single one of them. Some of them are old season as well. So I'll try and find like similar ones and link in the description for you. As I like to try and have like coats that last for so long in my wardrobe that are very, very timeless. I also think the majority of these coats are H&M. I feel like H&M coats are just amazing. They're really, really trendy. They're really, really good value and they're really good quality as well and they last for so long in my wardrobe but yeah I'm really looking forward to sharing my autumn winter coats with you guys today so I literally where do I start like just look at this rail I mean I'm just literally like oh my god I love my coats I love my coats so much so I thought we could start off with a blazer coat so I shared this blazer coat over on my Instagram so this is from Cara Millen I worked on a campaign with Cara Millen I absolutely love their pieces they're such good quality they're very very timeless and yeah I was really lucky to work on a campaign with them um, I really love this blazer coat as you can see it's really nice and thick I didn't really know that like blazer coats were a thing um, until I saw it on their website and I was like okay it's like a really thick and blazer um but i love this i love the thick lining as you can see again the sleeves are really thick i've already saw this over my instagram i'll put a picture on the right hand side of me wearing it um, and again i picked this up in a size small and i think this was around i can't remember learning how to it off of their website as well um but i'm sure this is around the 60 70 price point but again i'll link it in the description for you because i can't remember off the top of my head how much it was but again i really love the quality it also come in a nice camel color i think it also come in navy as well but i really love these blazer coats because you can literally style it as a blazer but then feel as warm as if you're wearing a coat there's also plenty of room for me to wear a bit of knit underneath as well i just really love the color of this as you can see it's very very me i think this color is called mocha or it's stone um, I picked this up in a size small and yeah I just had to share this gorgeous blazer coat with you guys. Then I have this trench coat, you guys would have seen this over on my H&M haul, you would have seen it on my Autumn Essentials video. Um, I was going to show you guys my Topshop one as well but I've already showed you that trench coat in my Autumn Staples video and my Summer Staples. I thought I didn't want to show you again but again I'll link it in the description for you in case you want to have a look at it. But yeah I really really love this, this has also been reduced now, it's in the bloody sale every single time but I don't think there's many sizes left or it might be sold out. Um, as always, Always, I'll link it in the description for you but I just really love the colour of this again you can totally wear it layered up I've already sold it on my Instagram layered over a blazer and whatnot and I did get this in the extra small small and it did come in then in a medium large but I think this coat again very very timeless gonna last my wardrobe for such a long time I just love the details of it I think it was like 79.99 but it literally has been reduced to 50% off so always the way but I just I do find like with coats like this and with the coats I'm going to show you on this rail most of the coats I bought these coats full price and then sometimes they've gone into the sale but then I wouldn't be able to get my size anyway because they just sell that fast like I always tend to buy coats that I just know are going to be a key piece and I just buy it straight away whether it's like I don't know early summertime or like going towards autumn time like I think some of these coats on that rail as well that I already got I bought in I think it was literally like before we even went fully into autumn so the end of August time and um, but now they're completely sold out and I just know I'm not going to be able to get them again so when you see a really good coat especially when it's from H&M or any brands like Topshop or Zara just buy it because it's going to go whether it's like sunny outside like, oh I don't need to get a coat yet it's not warm enough but if you really like a key piece and you just know it's going to sell then just buy it while it's in your size I beg you honestly there's that many coats I've missed out on and things I should have got and I'm just like why didn't I get that when I saw it or I'll share the links of things on my Instagram and I'm like oh my god the next time I'm not going to actually go and buy it myself now and then it's been sold out <laughs> So I'm just like, right, okay, make sure I always get it. But yeah, I really love this trench coat. It is really nice. They also do a shorter version as well. That's in the same colour and it's slightly cropped. I think it's a bit cheaper as well. It's $34.99. But I'll link it in the description for you as always. But yeah, I could not show you this lovely trench coat. Then I have a new trench coat, which is new in my wardrobe. This is from the campaign I worked on with Karen Millen. Again, this is real leather as well. The leather is so, so soft. I love the brown colour. I think it's a very, very timeless classic piece. I feel like it makes me look like really like well-dressed 
dressed and really smart. Like when I shot my campaign for Karen Millen and I was wearing the full outfit, I just felt like really well dressed. So if you've not seen that, I'll put a picture on the right hand side of me wearing it. But yeah, I really, really love the colour of this. It's absolutely gorgeous. Again, very, very timeless. I can dress it up, I can dress it down. And I picked this up in a size 10 as well, so I wanted more lace put underneath it. Again, this trench coat compared to the H&M one is a bit more fitted, a bit more tailored. I do find that with Karen Millen. I find that sizes do come a little bit smaller because they're more tailored, they're more smarter. But as you can see as well, it has this gorgeous line on the inside. Um, I just really love the colour of it. And again, I know it's been last in my wardrobe for such a long time. And it's definitely an investment piece to have in your wardrobe. Then next I have this gorgeous long jacket. So I absolutely love this. It is so, so nice. It's actually new in my wardrobe. So you might be seeing it on a H&M haul very soon. Because as always, I can't stop shopping at H&M. So you're probably going to see this coat very, very soon. But it's basically a jacket, as you can see. But it's a long style jacket. And I just really love the colours of this. As you can see, it's nice and creamy it's like I think it's like more it's like a beige but I feel like it has a pinky tone in it with the beige um, and again I picked this up in the size small as well I was going to go for the extra small but, but like I said in my River Island haul video last year I kept buying coats in extra smalls in size eights and I couldn't lay it underneath so I went for this in a size small and I feel like it does fit better yes it's oversized meant to look like that but I just feel like I'm more comfortable wearing like layers underneath as you can see as well the sleeves are quite wide but I just feel like it looks more cozy jackets are meant to look really oversized as well and as you can see it has this lovely line on the inside and I think this was $39.99 um, again really good value for H&M as always they have great pieces they also do this in a wall blend as well that's got like light blue so it's white with light blue in but it's a wall blend they do it in a grey I think it's like £99 but that's because it's a wall blend um, but again I'll link those in the description for you if you've not seen those um, but yeah I really love this colour it's very very me and I just really wanted a nice long jacket and this one is absolutely perfect then next I have this lovely wool blend coat which again is from H&M. I've already styled it over my Instagram a couple of times with a jumper dress. If you've not seen it I'll pop it on the right hand side. And with this coat I picked up in an extra small so you would have seen this coat already on my H&M haul but I find that when a coat from H&M say that it's oversized, like it literally says oversized, I always say get an extra small because I've done that in the past as well. I've gone like a small and then it's been too big, it's been too long sort of like on the shoulder bits but these bits have come a bit too far down but this is very very oversized but it's a really nice like thin wool material as you can see it's a perfect like transition coat so I've been wearing this so far in the autumn time and I know in the winter I can layer up more with it but as you can see it's nice and thin as well I just really love the oatmeal colour of it I love the buttons and I've worn this quite a lot already and I know it's a coat that's going to last in my wardrobe for such a long time I could definitely dress this coat up as well as it's nice and thin so it's not too heavy to wear out you want to get it for a nice meal or something you had a bit of a layer you wanted like a nicer longer coat that's not too thick but yeah I really love the colour of it it also has these nice little side slip details and again another coat from H&M that was, I think this was like $17.99 but again really good value for a wool blend coat. Obviously it's not expensive as the other ones because it's not got a lining in. Again I really love this coat, I love the style of it, I love the colour of it. I think the majority of the coats I'll be showing you today do have like this nice like tailored finish to it. I do really like oversized coats with a bit of a collar on. But yeah I really love this coat, it's very very me. Again I bought this quite early as well before it was even like full autumn time. I think I bought this at the end of August because I knew it was going to sell out. But I'll link it in the description for you below anyway just in case it does come back in stock and you can put your email in and it will let you know but yeah I really love this coat from H&M then next I have this gorgeous Hanes tooth coat so this is the new it coat from new look that everyone's been going wild for so if you've not seen it on Instagram I think everyone's been posting on Instagram it's been out of stock back in stock out of stock and people are like, oh my god it's back in stock um, so everyone's been rushing and buying it I got this as well with a 20% off they did like a 20% off discount so I think I got it for $49.99 with a discount it was full price at I think it was $59.99 yeah so it's $59.99 full price I did size up on this coat so like I said before I normally buy a size 8 but I saw quite a few people wearing this coat and they were saying they sized up quite a bit so I actually went for this in the size 12 and I'm so glad that I did it looks really nice oversized and I just love the tie belt detail I think a Hanes tooth coat again perfect classic to have in your wardrobe I don't know if you guys would have seen last season that H&M did one and it literally just sold out I think everyone's got that coat as well and I'm gutted that was one coat that I thought I'm not going to get it and then I didn't get it and I regretted it very very much so when I saw this new look one come out I was like right okay I need to get this coat this is the next new it coat that everyone's going wild for and if I don't get this and this was very similar to the H&M one but I think the H&M one was more of like a woven and as you can see this is like a more of a fluffy material and more woolly if you can see
see there but I really love the belt detail as well I love the sleeves I love the style of it I'm really glad that I went for a nice oversized look I went for the size 12 so yeah really happy I got my hands on this lovely Haynes tooth coat again it's such a classic piece and the perfect autumn winter coat as well then next is this gorgeous camel coat from again H&M I just love this this is another wall blend coat this was like 99 pounds but the quality of this is amazing like the lining is really thick again this is really heavy as well. I'm like holding it like oh my god it is so heavy I picked this up in the size extra small as well because it's very very oversized like if I got the size small it would have buried me as you can see it's really really long as well I just love the wall blend material it's really good quality it's nice and thick and I feel like a camel coat is a essential coat to have in your wardrobe like so if you're going to buy a winter coat I definitely recommend buying a camel coat because you can wear it in so many ways it's such a classic it's very timeless I definitely go for a nice tailored style like this coat that's very oversized um, I know it's gonna last my wardrobe for such a long time H&M did a version last year which of course I miss out on which I regretted so when I saw this one on the website this year I was like right okay, I need to get that coat because that's gonna be another one that's gonna sell out straight away but I think like I said a camel coat you can wear it casually you can dress it up uh, wear it with trainers, wear it with boots, you can literally wear it with so much. I think it's like the most wearable coat I think a camel coat is. Um, but yeah, really happy I got this coat and I just love it. It's so, so nice. And next I have this coat you would have seen from my River Island haul. I don't actually have a grey coat, that's why I went for it. I really love the herringbone print on it as well. Um, again, I picked this on the size 10 so I went oversized. But I do find that like, this coat is £110 from River Island. And my H&M ones are like being a bit cheaper. They are £99. I do think the River Island one is more expensive. But I then prefer the quality of the H&M one. Um, I do wish this, this was like a little bit more wider. But it is really nice. It's very, very tailored and very smart. Again, it's very classic. I'd wear it with a nice jumper dress underneath with some black boots. Um, you can style it in so many ways. And I didn't actually have a nice grey coat. And you can see here it has these nice little details on the top. Um, but yeah, I think a grey coat, again, if you wear more darker colours, if you wear a lot of black, so then a grey coat is good to have in your winter wardrobe. As you can see, the majority of my coats are beige and neutral because, as you guys know, I love my neutrals. I'm a very neutral girl and I feel like that's just my style. Um, so I don't wear dark colours very often. So me having this coat in my wardrobe, I'm like, wow, this is quite dark for me. Um, but again, it's very, very timeless, a really nice classic and it will last in my wardrobe for a long time. So if you wear dark colours, then I definitely recommend getting yourself a nice dark grey coat for the winter time. Then is this gorgeous cream coat. So you guys went wild for this over on my Instagram. I did a little picture hanging like two coats up. So I've been doing like these nice like product shots over my Instagram. I know a lot of you guys have followed me from my shoe pictures, um, from my like clothes pictures where I sort of like arrange clothes and hang them with some matching shoes and bags. That's sort of been my little thing. And I just feel like a lot of people have found my Instagram account and buy those pictures. And I literally did a picture, I've got a picture on the right hand side, of like this coat with a bag around it and the camel coat, which is just this one here. And literally, it did so well on my Instagram. I had so many DMs about this coat. Like, it did really well on my YouTube. I was able to give the link to so many people. I did a DM. I kept showing it on my stories. And this coat as well was only $69.99. Like, it was from the full collection. It's such a classic piece. It's so timeless. And I just love it. I'm so glad I got my hands in it. Because the PR team kindly sent me this coat. So if they hadn't have sent it me, I don't think I would have managed to get it. Because it literally went online and it was gone. Like, literally, not even a morning and it was gone. Because it was such a good price. It was a really nice classic fit. As you can see as well, the material is really, really nice. It's really, really nice and fluffy. I love the buttons. Again, I love this tie detail as well, as you can see. And I went for this in the size extra small as well because it was very, very oversized. Um, I just really love the long length of it. And I think a white coat is just a classic to have in your autumn winter wardrobe. I really love to create like winter white outfits on my Instagram. So I'll be styling more like all white looks for the winter time. I just really love that like style and aesthetic. It looks really, really nice. Um, but yeah, I really love this coat. And I do hope it comes back in stock. But H&M do do some really similar ones to this I've been showing on my stories so I'll try and link as many alternatives as I can in the description below for you um because I know that you guys went crazy for this one so I have got the link for this one as well anyway so I'll put it in the description for you in case it does magically come back in stock but you never know it's worth checking H&M stores as well because I find that I find some really good key pieces when I go into H&M like when um I could keep these goes online people then rush to buy it and not everyone keeps it so then I'd end up finding like these like online exclusives in stores as an online return so definitely check your local h 
item stores because you never know. I've managed to end up finding quite a few key pieces. I've managed to find the um, the knitted vest in there. I found the black one. I found the other one that everyone went mad for, but which on the right hand side of me wearing it. I managed to get that in store. So do check your local stores because I feel like with online, once it's gone, it's gone. But then just go and hunt in the stores because you never know. You might land on this lovely cream coat. Then the next coat is this Zara puffer coat. This is literally my most worn coat because this is my dog walking coat. So I wear this every single day when I make walking Hugo. It is from Zara. I got it last year. Again, they do it in different colours as well. They've brought it back this year as well. Um, but it's a bit different to this. I think the, the zip's a different colour and whatnot. So I'll link this year's version in the description for you. They also do it in black and they do it in a nice like white grey as well. Um, I love white grey puffer coats, but I'm just like, is it really practical? Like when I'm out do dog walking, like Hugo will sometimes jump at me or I'll just walk past like on this dirt, on the wall or something. I just like, yeah. I think a white puffer coat isn't really practical. That's why I went for this colour and it's also down a feather as well. Um, it is waterproof, like water resistant, but I wouldn't say it's fully waterproof. Like when I've worn this out in the rain, like really bad, like torrential rain, like it's literally got really wet and you can like see the feathers through the material here. But it is super, super warm. It has really thick pockets. It's also got a nice big hood as well that's nice and practical as this is the only coat I have that's got a hood on it. So I always buy fashion coats. I didn't actually have a practical coat. Coat. So when I saw this in Zara, I was like, right, okay, I could wear this dog walking. But it's also a really cool coat as well because puffer coats are a huge trend right now. They come back every single season. You can wear them really casually. Like I love it when people wear them like with loungewear, with their trainers and hoodies underneath. It literally looks so, so cool. I think when I got this coat, I got it in a size small. Like I said, I went to layer up underneath. And I think it was like at the time, $79.99. Um, I think the new one is the same price as well. But of course, I'll link in the description for you. But as you can see, a little bit of wear and tear on here. I've got some threads and whatnot but I literally live in this coat every single day and I've definitely had my cost per wear out of it. It is the perfect dog walking coat. It's very, very cool as well. And again, it's very on trend too. Now onto the thicker Rudy Winter, the teddy and the fur coat. So the first coat I have, which is like a really nice winter coat, is this gorgeous teddy from H&M. I've had this for two years. Like I absolutely love it it's lasted my wardrobe for such a long time it's from the h&m log range and i got this in the extra small as it's very very oversized they haven't launched like this exact copy this year because this one is as you can see very very long but they've also done a bit of a shorter length this year and it's got like chunky pockets on so i'll try and link some similar ones as well in the description for you but i just really love this coat i've literally worn it so so much like this teddy like palm material just lasts for such a long time in your wardrobe again it's another coat that i've had my cost per wear out of it um, I did have one that was from Miss Selfridge that was a bit darker than this. Um, but I then decided to set it on Depop because I had this colour and I feel like this colour went with a little bit more. Um, so if you've not seen my Depop, I'll link that as well in the description below for you. So I have been selling some other coats. Like I said, I have a one in one out system. And I'm trying to be quite strict with myself this year on what coats that I'm accepting or what I'm buying or whatnot. So do keep an eye on my Depop as I am having like clearance constantly, like getting rid of other bits that I don't wear anymore. Um, but yeah, really love this coat. I think a teddy coat is a perfect like sable to have in your winter wardrobe. It's definitely a must have coat. I have seen a really nice like teddy coat from monkey that's like this sort of silhouette with the big collars on and it's like cream teddy material and it's sold out and i'm like damn why didn't i see that i think it's like 79.99 as well so that i'm currently got my eye on that coat i'm hoping i get my hands on it because it's so nice um i just really really love it i wanted the nice like long um like teddy coat as well um, but yeah, I really, really love this. I've worn it so much. I also wear it dog walking sometimes as well when it's dry. Um, it's really good coat to layer up underneath as well. I've worn this coat when I've been traveling. I took it to New York last year. It literally is so warm. So yeah, definitely a fab coat to have in your winter wardrobe. It's definitely a must have as well. Then next I have this lovely coat from Topshop. So Topshop bring this coat back every single year. This year so far they've bought it out in a longer version. They've not actually brought the crop version back yet, but I reckon they will very, very soon because it's been like on the Topshop website for the last three years. I've had this for two years now. It comes out every single winter. This is a size eight as well as it's very, very oversized, but I just really, really love it. It's really, really thick and very, very cozy. Um, and again, I've just worn this so much. I love the material of it. It's very, very warm. As you can see, the lining's lovely. Um, it's just a perfect autumn winter coat to have and like I said it comes out every single year so I'll try and link um, some similar ones to this one in the shorter length but I'll also link the longer length that Topshop are currently doing now. It's just so so warm and snug. Like, when I wear this coat I'm just like oh my god I feel so so snug and because it's cream as well it goes with everything. I've also been caught in the rain with this quite a few times and it hasn't gone like all matted and horrible. I know sometimes like, I feel like this teddy coat has gone a little bit like 
what would I say? Like, you know when you have a rug and it goes a little bit matted and it goes a little bit dreadlocky? Like, I feel like this teddy coat has sort of lost its, like, softness a little bit, but it is, like, two years old. I have been caught up in the rain quite a lot of it. I used to wear it to work all the time as well before I did this full time. I used to literally live in it. Um, but this has been caught in the rain quite a few times as well, and it's actually stayed really, really nice. It hasn't gone, like, all matted together and whatnot. It's still very, very soft and still very furry and very fluffy. So, yeah, another gorgeous coat from Topshop. Then the next coat is this gorgeous faux fur coat from h and I actually haven't took the tag out of this yet because I've not really worn it that much. Um, I got this in a size extra small and it was at $69.99. But again, I really love this coat. It's so, so soft. I love the button detail. It also has these lovely coat pockets as well, as you can see. I'm just really excited to start wearing this this winter time. So like I said, I didn't get anywhere of it last year. Um, I just really, really love it. They also did it in like other colours as well. Last year, they did it in a nice brown colour. They also did it in black as well. So I reckon they'll bring another H&M coat out like this. Like this is from the H&M Trend collection as well. I think H&M Trend have some really nice faux fur coats. And I've been keeping an eye out like this year as well and see if any new coats have come online because as those faux fur coats do last so long in your wardrobe. And again, they're so soft as well and they have a lovely lining on the inside. I also have a nice light pink one as well. Um, in this sort of style, it literally is so, so lovely. And I just really love how soft it is and again I just can't wait to wear it this year then finally I have another gorgeous faux fur coat which again is also from H&M again this is I think two years old and um, I really really love it I wear it every single winter it literally is so so nice I mean look at the color of it it literally is so so lovely I picked this up in a size extra small as well this is also a H&M trend coat as well like I said they do the best like style faux fur coats um, it literally is so, so cosy and I can't wait to start wearing it. Um, I want to get a nice black faux fur coat this year. I have seen one on H&M online at the moment and it's only $69.99 as well, which is really good value for a faux fur coat. I actually got this coat in the sale. Um, I got this coat in the sale when I actually worked at H&M and I also had my staff discount. I think I got this coat for like £15. It was like so, so cheap. Um, I do miss my H&M staff discount when I used to work there. Um, but yeah, it has some lovely deep pockets as well. It got some nice buttons here, as you can see. It's just a really nice winter coat and a faux fur coat that I get out every single year and it's just lasted so long in my wardrobe. So that is my coat collection video, guys. I hope that you've liked all the coats I've just showed you in this video. Like I said, some of these coats are new. Some are like two, three years old. Um, I do have lots of coats. Like This isn't like all of my coats, which is really bad because there's a lot of coats here but these are definitely some of my favorite ones and i feel like the new ones i just showed you as well are really timeless they're really classic and they're gonna last in my wardrobe for such a long time and when it comes to probably doing a autumn winter or a coat collection next year sort of video i'm sure i'll be showing you these coats once again and of course if i do buy any more coats which i'm more than likely i'm going to so do keep an eye out as i probably will do another coat video for the winter time so yeah if you're new to my channel and you're watching this video please do hit that subscribe button and please do give this video a nice big thumbs up you've liked all the coats that i've just showed you so as always i'll link everything in the description for you as well as many similar items that i can as well as well as the ones i've just mentioned like to talk to you guys anywhere that i've seen and um, so you can have a little shop and find some winter coats for yourself so as always thank you so much for coming back to my channel and watch this video and i'll see you on the next one bye guys mm -hmm.